Welcome to Chapter 3 of our thrilling underwater adventure. As dawn breaks over the mysterious abyssal realm, a haunting stillness envelopes the dark waters. The only sound is the distant echo of the ocean's depths. Here, we find our heroes standing at the edge of a rocky outcrop, their hearts pounding with anticipation. The air is thick with tension, a reminder of the impending confrontation with the tyrannical sea witch. Join us as we dive into this epic tale of courage and friendship. Goku, now transformed into a radiant sea creature, stands at the precipice of a rocky outcrop. His scales shimmer like the sunlit surface of the ocean, reflecting his inner strength and resolve. Beside him is Vegeta, a fierce mare warrior adorned with glowing tattoos that pulse with energy. His fists are clenched, and his brow is furrowed in determination. The shadows of their past loom large, intertwining their fates with that of the sea witch, whose betrayal had birthed her dark magic. Goku turns to Vegeta, his voice steady yet filled with an undercurrent of anxiety. We've trained hard for this moment, Vegeta. We can't let her darkness consume us. We fight for the balance of our world. Vegeta nods, though doubt flickers in his eyes. The memories of their previous battles weigh heavily on him, each skirmish a reminder of his insecurities. Yet, as he looks at Goku, he feels a flicker of hope. The bond they have forged through trials has transformed them into something greater than mere warriors. They are allies, brothers in arms. The abyssal realm stretches before them, a foreboding landscape of jagged rocks and swirling currents. The light barely penetrates the depths, casting an eerie glow over the scene. As they descend into the darkness, the water grows colder, and the shadows deepen, wrapping around them like a shroud. Goku can feel the weight of the sea witch's magic pressing against his chest, a reminder of the stakes at hand. Suddenly, a chilling laugh echoes through the water, reverberating off the rocky walls. The tyrannical sea which emerges from the shadows, her figure cloaked in darkness, eyes glowing with malevolence. Ah, the heroes of the Coral Empire come to challenge me. How quaint. Her voice drips with disdain, each word a dagger aimed at their resolve. Goku steps forward, his heart racing but his spirit unyielding. We won't let you continue your reign of terror. The dragon crystals belong to the ocean, not to you. Vegeta, feeling the surge of camaraderie, joins Goku's side, his voice a low growl. You've taken enough from us. It ends here. As the battle commences, the water around them erupts in chaos. Goku summons the currents, weaving them into powerful blasts of energy, while Vegeta unleashes his elemental magic, the tattoos on his skin glowing fiercely. Each strike against the sea which is met with a counter of dark magic, the clash of light and shadow creating a tempest of power. In the midst of the chaos, Goku feels a moment of doubt creep in, a whisper of uncertainty that threatens to unravel his focus. But then he glances at Vegeta, who fights with fierce determination, and the mermaid warrior, who rallies their allies from the depths. The realization strikes him. They are not alone. Together, they are stronger. With renewed resolve, Goku and Vegeta synchronize their attacks, their movements fluid and harmonious. The tide of battle begins to shift the darkness receding as their combined strength illuminates the abyssal realm. Yet, the sea which is relentless, her magic swirling around her like a tempest, each spell a reminder of her tragic past.